you are in his twenties? You are in your twenties? You are in your, oh my god, look at you, so fresh. <laughs> what is your name, brother? Onat. Onat. What does Onat actually mean? Growth. Growth. There are so many things I can say to that. <laughs> Onat, how old are you? 22. 22, oh my god, okay. 20, okay, so few people in their 20s. People in your 30s, 30s, give me a cheer. Sounding way happier than the people in their 20s, by the way. Okay, 40s, 40s, give me a cheer. This is just peer pressure. So you are in your 40s? Oh my god, the years have not been kind. I'm kidding, I'm just messing with you. 50s, 50s, give me a cheer. Happy guys, children have gone. 60 year old, don't cheer, just breathe, just breathe. Uh, I want to tell you a little bit about my background. Like I said, I grew up in Kolkata uh, and I grew up in a middle class family. Anyone else here grown middle class? Anyone grown up middle class in your church? You would know this when you grow up middle class, you grow up with a certain set of values. The greatest value of all those values is value for money. So give me a cheer if you grew up in a house like this. I grew up in a house where shampoo never finished. It just magically became thinner over time. <laughs> I grew up in a house with a bottle that had tomato sauce, eventually had tomato soup. You need photographs? Yeah, on your phone? Yeah, let's see the last one you took. <laughs> Don't want to see it. Seriously, that naughty. You know the last time I asked a 22-year-old, I looked at his phone, there were three photographs of his pasta. We didn't have this luxury because we had film roles. Anyone remember film roles? Yes. Yes, if you came from a rich family, you got a role of 36. If you came from a middle class family, you got a role of 24. And we had those cameras, when you took those photos, those numbers kept going past. One, two, three, four. But on our day, even after we got to 24, we would take a chance. And sometimes you got that one extra photograph. It was like winning the lottery. I mean, if I took a bunch of photos, they went to get developed and it came back and there were three photographs of my pasta and everybody slept. <laughs> now they say, oh, he's not showing me his phone. Do you know why? He's 22 years old. They saw porn on their phones. <laughs> Siddharth is in his 40s. He didn't have this luxury. <laughs> I'm 46 years old. I remember growing up in Kolkata. The internet had just come. You couldn't download a video. At best, you could download a photograph, you're laughing, so this is a laugh of recognition. You know what I'm talking about. Right? And you know how we used to load, first you had the head, then you had the eyes, then you had the nose. By this point, 18 minutes have gone, you're already getting warmed up. Right? From the side, you can hear that modem going, Till today, when I hear the sound of a modem, I get turned on. But it's different nowadays. One oh, asks 22 years old, do you have a girlfriend? You do have a girlfriend? How long have you been dating? Almost a year. Almost a year. What is the most romantic thing that you have ever done for your girl? Well, I've done a lot of things. I'm sure you've done a lot of things. I'm asking you about the romantic thing, not the things that are on your phone which you cannot show me or not. What is the most romantic thing you have done for her? I know you're buying time. <laughs> you can't even think this is a problem with this generation. Don't understand romance. Or not in our time we had romance. The smallest things. Our generation was to give her a mixtape. A compilation tape. Give me a chance. <laughs> in our generation we had something called an audio cassette. And giving a girl a mixtape was by far the greatest show of commitment ever. It's not like now you drag three files in the USB stick. You have to call all your friends. You have to find out all the songs that she loved. And calling your friends was easy either. Because or not, we didn't have mobile phones like you. We had dial up phones. Anyone remember dial up phones? Yes, yeah, you came from a middle class family like I did. You went to play with your friends, but when you asked them for those songs, you lost your self respect. Imagine an 18 year old guy going to his male friends and saying, Hey bro, do you have a... Nothing is going to change my last name. Exactly, they laughed. And the worst part was, each of them had that song. But at least we had songs that allowed us to express love. 
Nothing is going to change my love for you. You are the wind beneath my wings. Words are all I have. Or not? What the fuck do you have? <laughs> I mean, I heard a song the other day by Eminem. These are the lyrics, these are the lyrics of this song. I ain't never seen an ever seen an ass like that. The way she shakes it makes my pee pee go doin doin doin. <laughs> if my dad ever gave my mom a song that said I ain't never seen an ass like that, she would smack him so hard his pee pee would never go doin doin doin. <laughs> we have romance. Make sure we have exactly 45 minutes on each side just because. See, I don't want to make this an our generation versus your generation. But here's what I'm trying to say now. When we went out, we went out to have a good time. Now these people go out to take photographs of themselves looking like they're having a good time. You can be in the most boring party ever. Five guys will get together, take this photograph, stick it up on Instagram, say, oh my god! Sorry, OMG! Last night was epic. I do not understand the use of the word epic. The Ramayan was an epic. The Mahabharat was an epic. You going out and getting passed out in a pool of your own peace is not epic. No, this is a hashtag generation. So, your time, no tags, right? Just hash. <laughs> Alright, before we go further ahead, let's give Onat a huge round of applause for his for. Cheers, man. Alright, to present the next award, May I please invite on the stage Ashok Saraf, Vice President of Kerala Bengal, and Manju Agarwal, Director of Our Vision. Arja is involved by Arja Builder Private Limited, Vinaya by Vilani Care Housing LLP, Neva by Shukam and Diamond Group, The Hunger for House by Shukam, and Vanya by PS Group. And your winner is... It is Vanya by P.S. Group. of the year and your nominees are there is just one nominee and one winner cyclone and flood tolerant houses by Sri Jam Reality Different 
places. And often your travel experience depends on this prayer. They clean your glasses. Now, sir, I didn't know this. I'm sitting on this business class seat. This gorgeous air hostess walks up towards me. What happened to you, sir? <laughs> but it's pretty embarrassing when you're standing in business class with your pants around your ankles saying, Give me the Kingfisher experience. <laughs> One of them is Michael Schumacher versus Billy Driver. <laughs> he wanted to pick a fight. He said, I'm gonna fuck you, man. I'm gonna fuck you. Come outside, you come outside. I said, I'm sorry to disappoint, brother, but I never come outside. <laughs> I said, come on, I'm Indian. We did not get to a population of 1.4 billion by coming outside. And he was like, I'm going to kill you, I'm going to kill you. I said, my friend, it doesn't matter if I die. I'm Hindu, I'll be reborn. And for all you know, sir, I'll be born as your child. And then I'll be sucking on your wife's, you know what, and you won't even know it's me. My name is Papa CJ. I am available for children's parties. I'm just joking. All right,